Hey, good morning, Summit. This is Edward. You know this guy, Jake. Weekly update coming at you right now, Jake. We got a lot happening right now. Hey, the streak is alive. What's the streak? 26 weeks in a row I've showed up. No breakfast made for me. Yeah, I know. I know. Uh, but you got coffee. Mm. You got coffee. Debatable. So, hey, we really have a lot going on. We want to jump right into it, okay. Jake. And just our Let's list jump. is happening. This Sunday, we have grief support, 12th. Um, Immediately after the service. After service in a generations area. So yep. make sure that you're aware of that's going on. If you got somebody, know somebody, bring somebody, uh, the whole nine yards. Also, Disciple Now is a week from tomorrow. Yep. Can you believe that? Uh-huh, uh, I can. Or Friday, a week from Friday. So if you're watching this on Sunday, it's this coming Friday. Right. Uh, which is really amazing, man. This thing is coming up Six so through fast. 12th grade. Area wide event. If you've not gotten your uh, teenagers signed up, make sure you get with David today uh, or this week week get them signed up for that there's a whole lot going on uh in our community that weekend so uh make sure you're uh aware of what's happening because this is life change jake yeah. we've been talking story over the last month and a half I'm telling you, there's gonna be some teenagers get some story out of this uh life change of what god's gonna do so and they get a t-shirt they do get a t-shirt so uh also we want to mention that on the 26th the last sunday of this month we have three things happening jake one is membership yep. uh, for people who are wanting to check out summit heights yep. find out what we're about statements strategy our structure yep. so important to really understand why we do what we do uh and who we are and so if you want to know about that uh you can sign up for that or just show up uh immediately after the service room yep. a 101 Great, great, great uh, time with Jake and one of our elders as they kind of walk you through that. Doesn't mean you're a member when you take that. It just means, hey, this is who we are. Yeah. And then if you choose to join and be a part, then they'll kind of walk you through what that looks like. Also on that day is uh, Women Facing Cancer. Uh, that'll be taking place. So just in generations, in generations, just want to make you aware of that. Uh, if you know somebody that would benefit from that, encourage them to be there. It's on the LED sign. Yeah. It kind of reminds you all that good stuff. And then this, Jake, I'm really excited about for our kiddos. Because also on that 26, we have membership, we have women facing cancer, and then after church, our kid venture kids are going to go to Safety City in Longview. So I had somebody ask me about that. We have the most creative, most talented children's minister on the planet. You, you know, know her that? pretty well. Did don't you know you? that, Edward? You, you know her pretty well, don't you? So the whole theme that they're doing uh, is called Road Rules, all right, for the month of February. So when they wrap up this theme of Road Rules, they're going to take the kids to Safety City. That's cool. Pretty talented. That's cool. And young lady. And there's going to be a really cool special guest yep. there uh, to kind of help guide them through yep. the city. So it's going to be good. I love to see our adults getting involved yep. and uh, kind of goes along with what we've been talking about last month of just plugging in, get involved, volunteer. And if, you, if you're not serving somewhere, uh, I would encourage you to get that card in the back seat of the chair or go by the first impressions table because we would love to have you plug in somewhere and serve children, youth, first impressions, um, all those different areas. So uh, get signed up for that. Also, Jake, March the 5th, we have child dedication. Yes. Uh, so if you're interested, you got a baby that has not been dedicated. This is not salvation. I know some of you come from different backgrounds. This is just a commitment to the parents that, hey, we are dedicating not only this child to the Lord, but to raise this baby in a way that one day that child will make a decision for Christ and be a Christ follower. So if you want to get involved in that, you can reach out to um, Kristen or Ashley in our children's and preschools department, and they can kind of get you um, what you need for that. Uh, also, Jake, this is amazing. Uh, before I get to our last deal, you notice anything different? You trimmed your goatee? You know, there's some people that's been harassing me and, and you will remain nameless on this video about me cutting my beard off. No. I cut three inches off of this dude. I'm thinking that's worth about a thousand dollars an inch. What do you think? Um you mean like to tithe? Yeah. Oh, okay. Hey, I got another tithing idea. What's that? Like to hear about What's it. that? Did had to do with my beard and all cleaned up? So I'm excited about this Sunday. Yeah. You preached a great message last week. Yeah. But yeah. I'm really excited about this Sunday. 
You got Kansas City Chiefs, Philadelphia Eagles in the Super Bowl. Super Bowl, yeah. And you know how you do the squares and you can buy a square and then they assign you numbers like seven and three. And at the end of the first quarter, if it's seven and three, you win like 250 bucks. So I say we do a square deal. Everybody signs up. But instead of giving out money, if you win that square, you have to give your tithe like an extra that, 250 bucks. That probably will be the lowest played game I've ever seen in my life. If, anyway, if we do I'm that, always so. trying to come yeah. up with creative ways for people to get involved. Well, I just, I just thought it'd be kind of fun, you know, to challenge some of these folks that's been here. I do know me. somebody that would give a hefty sum to see you shave the entire thing off. Well, let's just see what that amount gets up to mm-hmm. and uh, let's see what happens. Okay. So, uh, hey, I do want to invite you to Sunday morning at 9 a.m. We have a prayer time and I would love for you to come and be a part of that. It's, uh, it's very informal. We're praying over our service uh, for God to move, for God to do some incredible things. And then on Mondays at one o'clock, again, this is the way you can get involved, Jake, to use your gifts. At one o'clock on Monday, there's a group of people that meet uh, at our church and they pray. Tuesday. Tuesday. I'm sorry, Tuesday. That's right, Tuesday. Uh, So scratch that Monday thing. You can come pray Monday. But uh, Tuesday at one o'clock that you can come and pray and they pray over all the prayer requests that come through on Sunday, through our website, through email, Mm-hmm. Uh, it's a great time of worship as well. Yeah. Uh, our worship pastor, Andrew, is a part of that and kind of helps lead that and give leadership in that in there for that time of prayer. So I want to invite you. You're looking for a way to plug in. You're looking for a way to see God really do some cool stuff. Come join us in prayer. Uh, uh, that, that happens every Sunday, 9 o'clock, every Tuesday at 1 o'clock. So, Jake, what else do we have uh, this morning, that's, that's a lot. It. That's a lot. Yeah. Uh, grief this Sunday. Uh, if you're listening, that's today uh, on Sunday. If you're listening to this on Sunday morning, that's today. Uh, I have Disciple Now uh, coming up next weekend. If you're listening on Sunday, this weekend. <laughs> Uh, membership on the 26th, Women Facing Cancer, Kids Safety City on the 26th, a lot going on. Uh, and then child dedication on March the 5th. Uh, so listen, man, keep up. Look at the calendar. Look at Facebook. Look at Instagram. Look at all your different platforms that's going on and be following, sharing, inviting. Also, I'd still love to see your stories. We're collecting stories all year long about what God's doing. Edward at summitheightsfellowship.com. Send those to me. And so, Jake, this this kind of brings us to the end. We're about seven oh, minutes yeah. in. When people checked out a lot. You think people's listening to this at all? No. So if you've stayed with us on this uh, to the end, since I hadn't given Jake breakfast, uh, would you say 26, 26 weeks? 26 weeks. weeks. He'll buy you breakfast if you've listened to the end of this. So we love you. Can't wait to see you summit. Get the word out. Uh, have a great weekend.